Scientists just discovered a way to turn plastic waste into fuel. Let's make this fuel, baby! PVC, or polyvinyl chloride, makes up about 10% of all plastics. But unlike most other easily recycled plastics, it's nearly 60% chlorine by weight. That makes it a nightmare to recycle, as it can contaminate waste streams, and if it's accidentally burned, it risks releasing a range of toxins. So, a team of researchers, including experts at the East China Normal University, which is the world's best name university, have now cracked a way to convert it into gasoline-like liquid fuels. The process uses chloroaluminate ionic liquid, essentially a salt that is liquid at room temperature. When shredded PVC is added, the ionic liquid breaks its carbon chloride bonds, and the chlorine is safely captured, mostly as hydrochloric acid gas, which can be safely collected and sold. On the polymer, this leaves behind positively charged carbon sites, which are unstable and cause the chain to fracture into smaller fragments. Normally, those fragments would stick back together into a tar-like mess. But to control them, the researchers added molecules of isobutane, which can donate hydrogen and attach the reactive fragments, capping them before they can recombine. The end result is a 95% yield of clean, chlorine-free liquid mixture remarkably similar to gasoline. If scaled up, this method could provide an energy-efficient way to upscale millions of tons of PVC and mixed plastics that otherwise can't be recycled. And if we can adapt the process to other plastics, who knows, maybe we can finally turn everyone's plastic bag full of plastic bags into a literal gold mine. If you like science and are now excited to moonlight as an oil baron, follow for more.